Spicy 4K action. What's going on, everybody? Spicy 4K action. Happy Friday to everyone. Hope everyone's week's going well. I'm super excited for today. Got a couple things going on that maybe I'll share later on a short or something. But uh, today, I wanted to do a quick unboxing of the 4K Steelbook of Venom. There will be Carnage. This is the reprint that Sony was doing with a bunch of them. And I held off on getting this for the longest time. I didn't really love this movie. I didn't hate it, but it definitely wasn't as good as the first one, in my opinion. Um, so when they re-released a couple of those, I only picked a few of them. Uh, Spider-Man No Way Home being one of them that I missed out on. But this one, uh, the artwork always really called to me. I really like this artwork compared to the first Venom Steelbook. But I don't know, just the price and the movie quality, I was just like, eh. But <laughs> for whatever reason... They keep lowering the prices for these, and I just picked this up from Amazon for, I think, just a little over 20 bucks. Uh, and being as it's a Sony, uh, you know the quality and the transfer is going to be fantastic. So um, I decided to grab it. So we got it here today. Let's do a quick unboxing of what we got inside so we can see what that artwork looks like behind the J card there. Um, got some of the special features, but this is Dolby Vision, Dolby Atmos. All that good stuff. It's a Sony release. You know it's going to be good. So let's get this plastic off. Let's take a look. What do we got here? And right away, I can tell you this is a matte finish. And this is very, very nice. Let's take a look at that bad boy. Oh, yeah. In all its glory. Very, very nice artwork. Uh, yeah, I don't know if... <laughs> this is just incredible to see in person. But uh, I wish the movie was as good as this artwork is. And we'll just take a look at the back there. Look at that. Is that not just sweet or what? Yeah, that's awesome. This is one just to put out on the display case to show off because it's just so incredible. You see the spine here. Nothing too ecstatic. Get this bad boy opened up. So there is a digital code. And we do have some disc art, which is always appreciated with any release. Studios, listen up. Uh, well, we got the 4K here. So nice looking disc art there, not too shabby. And then we got the Blu-ray, which uh, is okay as well. Nice that there's some differentiating there. And we do have some inside artwork as well, which I really like. So all in all, this is a just a knockout release from Sony in my opinion, as far as the packaging and the artwork. I mean, this is just absolutely stunning. Uh, I don't know any other adjectives or nouns to say here, but uh, this is uh, just a very, very nice, again, I'll, I'll reiterate, the movie is not as good as this artwork is, but uh, I do enjoy it. I just feel like the movie's just trying to be too funny in parts, and kind of they kind of play on that and let that go for a little too long. Um, and they didn't show enough Carnage, of course. Um, I think everyone was excited to hear that Carnage was going to be in this. Uh, and I think a lot of people were let, were let down with the amount of time he's in the movie, but, uh, maybe that's just me. But either way, I'm definitely going to be revisiting now that I have this in the collection. Uh, and yeah, let me know down below what you think of this steelbook. What do you think about this movie? Uh, and, uh, yeah, guys, we'll see you all in the next one. Uh, hope everyone has a great weekend. Stay safe out there and peace.